Many people think of science as apolitical, concerned with facts, not political views, values, or opinions. However, when it comes to science-based policy and legislation, science no longer seems unbiased. The prevalence of opinions and biases in policy debates has led countless members of the scientific community to avoid policy debates despite their ability to provide helpful contributions. However, science and politics are more intertwined than most people realize. Science helps lawmakers write policies and regulations that affect our everyday lives. At the same time, government shapes science through budgets, laws, and regulations. Using NASA, the National Aeronautics and Space Administration, as an example, let's walk through how our federal policies have shaped research. In 2018, Congress provided NASA with an annual operating budget of $16.5 billion. Why did the federal government invest so heavily in NASA's research? First, public demand for scientific research can strongly influence politicians. Motivated by increasing public concern, lawmakers have funded research to investigate climate change's causes and mitigate its effects. This research is closely tied to NASA's work in outer space. Satellites monitor Earth's atmosphere and solar panels, which power most spacecraft, are an emerging alternative to fossil fuels. Congress also funds research because it recognizes the potential for research to have broad societal impacts in unexpected ways. As a result, many groundbreaking technologies, like GPS and advanced prosthetic limbs, have their roots in NASA technology. Second, global competition and national security concerns motivate federal funding for NASA. The space race, which was one of the many arenas in which the United States and the Soviet Union fought the Cold War, ushered in NASA's growth. After the Soviet Union shocked the United States by building Sputnik, the world's first orbiting spacecraft, NASA's successful moon landing in 1969 restored national pride and garnered international recognition. NASA has also developed numerous military aviation technologies like composite materials, fly-by-wire cockpits, and wingtip winglets that were later adapted for commercial aircraft. Government priorities shift with time, and this is reflected in NASA's budget. For example, Near the height of the space race in 1966, the fraction of the federal budget dedicated to NASA was almost 10 times as large as it is today. By contrast, adjusted for today's dollars, the National Institute of Health's budget grew threefold between 1970 and 2005. Now, let's examine how science influences policy. Many beneficial laws, like the Clean Air Act of 1970, have been the result of scientific research, and scientists are frequently consulted as experts when bills are drafted. Scientific research also serves as the basis for entire federal institutions like the Department of Energy, which regulates nuclear material and funds energy-related research. As we can see, scientific research shapes policy and vice versa. Every generation has new challenges that need scientific solutions, Ensuring that our nation's students are provided the education and training to meet these challenges, both through science and policy, is crucial to the success of our nation and the world.